The tech world has made obtaining huge pets so much easier. Not only is there a lot of huge pets that you can hatch with this update, they are very easy to obtain. So today you might be able to get your first huge pet. The new update log talks a lot about new ways that you can obtain huges as well as obtaining possibly up to 7 different free huge pets that you can get. And my goal today is to make your chances the best as they can possibly be for every single one of them. The first and by far the least hardest one to get in my opinion is gonna be inside of area 109. If you actually travel to the tech jungle right on over here, you will see there is a diamond wheel game mode which you can do for a huge. And let's go ahead and enter it and as you can see this is a very simple game mode of literally spin the wheel. However, be careful because some um, gamble addiction could be bad in this mode. As you can see, inside of the wheel is a huge high-tech tiger that you can obtain by spinning the wheel, which costs 30,000 diamonds. Well, why is that good? Well, not only is the chances not too low, because it's really not, but the fact that you can actually spin this a lot, and there is no cooldown. So if I were to spin it just like so, click the X, and go back on it, as you can see, I can just spin it again, and I can continuously go on ahead and do this until I get the huge pet. You can also even get it in golden form and I also believe rainbow form. Sometimes it will turn gold and um, I believe it does also turn rainbow. However, I am not 100% sure with that yet. But the chances are very low. It is 0 0.01, meaning that it is 1 in 10,000. And how much does that cost? Well, if we were to do some simple math, have 10,000 and every time it costs 30,000 to spin it would cost you up to 300 million gems but that's honestly if your luck is really bad and I will say right now it will probably be worth it by the time you're seeing this video I would get it quick if you plan on using it because only 130 of these exist it is a pretty good system if you really think you're lucky. But that is only one of the seven different ways you can get huges. The next one is actually within every single mini game inside of the game. And actually for this one, we're gonna have to travel back to world one. So here we go, let's go to teleport rocket and teleport back into the OG world. Oh my god, man, it really feels weird being here again. But for this, you actually want to go to the autumn area because this is where the first obby can be found, the classic obby. Completing this has a chance of giving you a huge colorful wisp by going over to that chest right on over there. How often can you get it? Well, we're about to find out. But if you go here and claim this, you have a chance of getting a huge pet. And it looks like it has a one hour cooldown on it. But there is a chance to get a huge pet and as well as a bunch of other rewards, which I think is pretty cool. Yeah, look at that. You can get the huge colorful wisp in normal, a golden, as well as rainbow. And right now, not many of these exist, only 37. So this thing is going to go for a lot. And then what you can just do is finish the obby bro because it's not hard to do at all oh, okay never mind yeah we're just gonna act like i beat it okay now i believe you can actually increase your chances by doing the obbies further on because there's multiple options such as the atlantis and pyramid obby which is rebirth 2 or you have to at least have rebirth 2 and uh, it does say the better the chest the higher rebirth required so your chances are going to be better in the higher areas such as the cart ride uh, to preston which requires rebirth 4 and as you can see it is like right there let's go ahead and actually go to that one real quick and if you really want to get to it quick i would just click instance right here and then just read what this stuff says so it's area 61 for anybody curious on where mr preston is this should have honestly been like a money area in like bikini bottom with mr Krabs, bro because it got preston in it and we know he loves money now where this chest is i am exactly not sure but let's go ahead and just grab a car and head on down for some reason you can see the tech world all the way from here i think that is a bug but the chest is right there so you don't actually have to get all the way to the top which is kind of nice but you do have to get to that point so you can get that chest and since i'm so curious on what is over here while the game is loading let's just go ahead and fly on over here and what is going on bro what is 
is this place? Bro, is this for like the chest raid or something? Um, okay, we are kind of experiencing technical difficulties on the road. Okay, the only way to actually get there now is by basically just walking through here. Please don't fall. Please don't fall. Please don't fall. I think if you have a really tall character, you can actually kind of parkour your way up here, which is really good. But I obviously don't have that. And here is the chest. So, yes, you can claim different chests per thing. And here we go. Let's make the jump and claim it. And okay, unfortunately, we did not get the huge pet, but this one does actually reward you more. There is um six slides, and the surge does apply to this, by the way. So if there is a surge going on, I would highly recommend doing it because it's very likely you're gonna get something good. I mean, you can get very good charms from this. But there is still so many more new ways. The next one can actually be found at the tech spinning wheel at the spawn in the tech world and well to get there we must take the rocket ship back on over to the tech world and let's travel on let us go and come on hello please launch it yo this one can be found at the spinning wheel right over here like i mentioned you can actually get a huge pet from this unfortunately mine isn't in the menu so i can't show you it but there is a huge pet on here come on please pop up and of course it doesn't pop up when I need it. And actually I do have a bonus huge pet that wasn't on my list and it is this one right here. The huge cyber agony you can obtain from this chest right here that you need a tech key with. And uh, I think right now tech keys are actually broken. I'm gonna try to make one, but oh wait, no, I apparently it looks like they fixed it. Back then you couldn't actually create these tech keys for whatever reason, but now you can actually create them and you have a chance of of hatching you know the brand new huge pet with these techies and to be honest they are pretty easy to get so i would highly recommend doing this one it's just like the wizard westy except a completely different huge pet it looks like none of these actually exist or something because the exist count on them is just non-existent aha you see what i did there you can also get a charm chisel which is very useful if you want to just get rid of a charm and put it back in your inventory but look at that. It looks like I just got a tech key out of the tech key thing. So I don't know how that works. But hey, I mean, it has decent rewards. I think it's worth it. Um, The better rewards have higher chances in this one. But you get the point. You can get a free huge pet as well as sprinklers. These are really good. This one also has it. However, I just don't have these tickets, bro, to buy it. And I don't think I can even just buy from the shop. Oh, wait. No, I can buy it. Okay, let's go ahead and just buy five times spinny tickets just so I can show you guys that this works. Come on. Would you like to please show up, sir? I would very much appreciate it. Okay, you can also get pet surges, which are, um, I believe, the ultimate. So that's pretty cool. But I don't know why it's not showing up. I promise you there is a huge pet in this one. I know one way to refresh the system is by constantly rejoining the server. So if you want to go ahead and do that, feel free to do so. The next thing you can obtain, which I think is by far one of the easiest, is the huge Lumi Axolotl in the secret area. I don't know if it's Lumi or Lumi, but it is this pet right here. If I search it up, as you can see, it is in the index. Only it says 14 exists, which I have no idea why. But as you can see, this thing is not very known at the moment. And I would definitely recommend doing this because by the time you're seeing this video, the developers are probably going to nerf it. In the update log, they mentioned secret room changes. Lou has been buffed overall, added in a huge Lumi Axolotl, new tier of potions and enchants, and amounts of items. Removed cheap cha charms such as bonus and agility as well as low tier items little did they know they made it too overpowered and oh my god we have to go back to world one again the best spots in my opinion to do this at is gonna be inside of area 50 the enchanted force this is where the first uh key area is and right here if i actually go ahead open it which by the way i have a lot of keys to spare i have a hundred of these still and they're currently going up in value as people find this out and i think you can get key parts by just playing the game as well as other ways such as i think hitting rebirth 
three. But let's go ahead and waste no time and go on in here. So hopefully we get good rewards here. And as you can see right off the bat, dude, we got Tap Power 7, which is completely overpowered. This is one of the new books. And to actually be able to use this, you need the Enchant Mastery of level 70, which um, to be honest, I don't think I actually own. But there's way better rewards such as the huge Lumi Axolotl, which has a very high chance of getting. I don't know why people aren't doing this. I mean, the update only released a few hours ago, so it's possible that nobody knows about this yet, but try it out. If you find out about it, don't tell the developers, bro. I am telling you, if the devs find this out, they are going to fix it. And there is it more crystal keys all this good stuff just keep doing this bro it's so good here's another set of books coin six by the way you can still get bad stuff here like poop and a boot so be careful but the loot i think is just way better i don't know if you should do this in any other mode the one mode i do not recommend doing this in is in the third one the third one can be found inside of the fairy castle and i would just not recommend it bro it is terrible bull sorry i had a hiccup there and oh my god we got another rainbow swirl and look at that bro which one do i take a charm stone or tap power i think low key i might have to go with the charm stone bro but you get the point if you can get these keys it's honestly way better now because your overall chances are even better because you're just gonna be getting decently good stuff if not even a huge bet the next one is actually one that is very commonly known, and that would simply just be the huge machine or the huge act of chances. They're, these are always rotating every day, and there is some brand new ones that they've added into this system. I highly recommend hatching if you can, because I mean, overall, these are still really good. I've had very good luck with them personally. I managed to hatch a huge robber pug, ramp. Rainbow. Oh my god, bro. These hiccups. I also has the rainbow huge night beagle as well as some normal huges. Bro, I'm telling you, I'm drinking water, but these hiccups are making it way harder to record. And these are the three brand new huges that you can get from um, the active huge chance. And it does say based on a set rarity, the huge pets will show more or less often. And they also brought back all the previous huges, um, excluding their first set of five pets. But right now, it is best to actually hatch primarily because of the huge happy computer. This is a very easy huge pet to hatch, and already 50,000 have been hatched. Only up to a million of these will exist. You can hatch it from any huge or any egg inside of the tech world. So you can hatch the best egg that you have, and you have a chance of getting two different um, huge, huge pets. I'm so sorry for these hiccups. But as you can see, the huge computer is in here as well as the chance of the active huge pet. But there is still two more ways of actually getting huges. And both of these are kind of bonuses that I decided to add to the video. The first one is inside of area 124, which you can find it right here, the chest raid. At the time I'm recording, it is going to open in like 2 hours and 30 minutes. And for this, you have a chance at a huge glitched cat. This is probably going to be very rare considering the fact it only happens twice a day. And that is at 12 p.m. and 10 p.m. CST. Surprisingly, this has already happened once. However, it was bugged. Only some clans somehow managed to participate in this. And it was these top three clans. I don't know if they did it with exploits or what. But this one person in here got all 20 points. This per one person here got all 16. And last but not least, somebody in this... This clan managed to get all 15. And not only that, but one of my good old friend DV actually complained about this too. Because this is how the clan war works. And they did not really consider people around the world in other time zones. Or people who have work or school or don't ha have pay to win pets. Because I am assuming that in this mode, you're actually going to need really good pets. It's called the chest raid. It has multiple stages. I can only assume that the health on the chest go up. And actually, I just noticed it does say complete the most rooms in the raid minigame. But I wouldn't recommend risk it for this one because the odds are still really low there is also a few more ways but i didn't really want to include them into the video because i didn't really consider it to be the best way of getting stuff or getting huge pets to say but just for anybody wondering the daycare now can actually give you a huge pet for example if i claim all of this okay i did not get the huge pet 
But if I were to um put my stuff in here, like enroll my stuff, and here, let's just go ahead and do all of this stuff. And um, hold on, let's get it down to like 35 exactly. As you can see, there's a chance of getting a huge Mebo in a spaceship. This is the same one that was in Pet Sim X. I'm kind of sad they brought it back. I thought this pet was cool when it was like kind of limited, but now it's back. You can also get a huge machine blur Dominus egg from this. So kind of two huges in one. I was actually lucky enough to be able to get one from this. And that is um, how I managed to hatch this Willow Wisp right here shiny. I could maybe give it away or something. I don't know if I want to try to sell it or what. But I think this dude looks pretty cute. But if I were to say what, in my opinion, is probably the top three, I would place this diamond wheel at the number three spot and then place probably the huge Lumi Axolotl that, like, you get in the, um, like, game modes and stuff inside of World 1 at the number two. And probably number one would have to be this huge computer for the time that it is still in the game. Because, I mean, all you do is just hatch this egg, bro, and you have a chance of getting two different different types of huge pets or actually four different types of huge pets so overall it's really good and in my next video i will be spending a lot of time on this egg with like the max luck possible to try to see how many of the huge computers i can get but if you guys enjoyed this video i would very much appreciate if you guys could join my discord server for my brand new game that is coming out very soon my new game is called pal tower defense it's coming very soon it's completely free to play or well you, it's very free to play friendly and i think you guys are gonna love it so much i already have a lot of leaks for it in my discord server so definitely go ahead and check it out i'm so excited to bring it out next week but if you enjoyed this video watch the video on the screen it's one of my best videos yet and i actually handpicked this one for you i think you're gonna enjoy it a lot so it would mean a lot to me if you could actually watch it so go ahead click it it's on your screen I'm waiting. Come on. Go ahead. Click it. Anyways, I hope you enjoy it. Goodbye.